Welcome to Art Storefronts. And if you're here, you're probably wondering who we are, what we do, and ultimately how we can help you sell your art or photography online. So to start that out, I'm gonna talk about the problem that is selling art and photography online. I wanna tell you a little bit about us. I'm gonna introduce our total art selling platform, and then we're gonna talk about our favorite subject, which is you. Let's talk about the problem. Selling art or photography, both online and off, is hard, it just is. Now, in order to frame this up, we're going mountain climbing. First, we're gonna climb mountain number one, then we're gonna climb mountain number two. Then I'm gonna tell you what most photographers and artists out there do, and then I'm gonna sum it all up. Mountain number one, selling art and photography bring with them a unique set of challenges. You've gotta deal with things like how to display it, how to price it, what different media options to offer. Uh, it's hard for your customers to visualize your art on their walls. And then most importantly, to sell art online, the shopping experience needs to be tailored to wall art and wall art alone, not selling handbags or swim fins or bicycles. Get over that mountain and we're to mountain number two. How are you gonna get customers to not just see your art, but actually buy it? In other words, marketing. Now, most artists and photographers out there struggle with marketing. Uh, where do you focus your energy? How do you go about getting set up for the basics and lead capture and SEO? And what about Facebook ads and Instagram ads? Most struggle with just working their day jobs or handling their service-based business or growing their business, and then even to find the time to create their art, let alone have the time for marketing. So what do most artists and photographers out there do? They either have no website at all. If they do have a website, it's usually a portfolio site, a pretty looking business card. And if their site is set up for e-commerce, it's usually a leave money on the table site. It's not set up to sell art and photography online. Many out there try the marketplace sites. This is one of our most common questions. Are you guys a marketplace? No, we're not. But there are so many out there that try them, whether it's the Saatchi art or the Fine Art or the Etsy or the Redbubble or even eBay. And the promise is, is that you can just upload your art and these sites are gonna deliver a flood of buyers and you just sit back and collect a check and don't have to do any work. Don't have to do any work on your marketing. And while the sites work for some, uh, for most, it's, it, they just don't end up penciling out. And you know, even if they do, you don't own those buyers. Those customers are not yours. The marketplaces own them. You can't market to them in the future. And so as such, the majority of your purchases become one-off purchases and it's sort of a, you know, a not ideal situation. Uh, many try marketing, but they lack the focus and consistency, the perspective of how long it takes to grow an online enterprise, and they quit early. Uh, you know, how often do you hear, yeah, I tried Facebook ads, uh, you know, I spent 500 bucks on them and, and, it, and they just didn't work. They quit. They quit after a month, a month and a half, or maybe you posted on social a little bit and didn't get much traction and you quit early. Uh, many hire consultants out there, perhaps an SEO consultant or a Google ads consultant or a Facebook ads consultant. And we hear from so many artists and photographers that for a number of reasons, these situations very, very rarely work out and very, very rarely last the long term. And there's a number of reasons for that. Many try the brick and mortar galleries. Some see some great success in the brick and mortar galleries. But again, you don't own those customers. And again, if you're working for you, fantastic, double down on them, but not in place of building your own website, your own contact list, your own customers that you can continue to market to in addition to the brick and mortar galleries. And then we see a lot of artists uh, and photographers both doing just the local show circuit and that's it, thinking that's the best they can do. That's the only thing that they found that works. Sum it all up and what do you get? A large number of struggling artists and photographers. A large number struggling to get their business to the next level, whatever level that business may be. Uh, whether it's you're looking for side income or you're doing fire the day job, or you really just want your business to reach the next level, it's really, really tough out there. We've spoken to thousands of artists and photographers, and this is a recurring theme we hear again and again. Is there any hope? That's the question. I'm gonna tell you a little bit about us. My name is Patrick, and I run marketing here at Art Storefronts. And yes, there is hope. Uh, let me tell you a little bit about us, our background, and then you can get into, we can get into why you should trust us. So who is Art Storefronts? We're a group of coders, support specialists, uh, seasoned marketers, art industry veterans, and artists as well based in Austin, Texas. And really what we do is we empower artists, photographers, and art galleries to live out their dream of selling art online and off and achieve the level of success that, that is their goal for their businesses. Now, we, we realized early on that if we were going to have a successful company, 
The only way to do that was going to be if we had successful customers. And a website in today's marketplace is sadly not enough. A website on its own is not going to create successful customers. And so we set about building from the ground up a total art selling platform. So what does that look like? First, let's, let's deal with this guy. Let's deal with this guy, the elephant in the room. Why you should trust us. So we've been in business for five plus years now. That's five long years of coming to work every day, attempting to solve the problems, the challenges, the difficulties that is selling art, both online and off. Uh, during that time, we've onboarded over 2,000 customers to the Art Storefronts family. And everybody loves talking about the numbers, so let's talk about the numbers. In Q4 2018, so just this last uh, Q4, uh, total customer sales through their website on our platform was a little bit over $10,800,000. Those orders were, or that amount was spread around a total of 67,431 different orders. And in that group, we have everything from folks that are just getting started. Perhaps they've been selling well offline, but they're just getting started online. Uh, to folks that are picking up steam, getting over the 1,000, 5,000, and 10,000 uh, in total online sales mark. And then we've got our rare unicorn, some of which sold you know, well into the six figures in Q4 alone. And then we've got everything in between as well. It's different for everybody. We have our blog, uh, which is laser focused on how to sell and market art online. The blog has uh, been viewed over 1,226,000 times by 784,000 unique users uh, that have created over 1.8 million page views. We've got the Art Marketing Podcast, How to Sell Art and Generate Consistent Monthly Sales. Uh, the podcast, I believe, has over 85, I think, uh, five-star reviews on iTunes, and it's been downloaded 155,000 times by 110,000 unique listeners. We've got the Art Storefronts Facebook page, which is up to 64,000 likes, and we have well over, I believe, like 145, 150 five-star reviews that you can check out uh, if you'd like. Point is, point in all that is we've been at this for a number of years now. Uh, we've gained the knowledge and experience on what it takes to successfully sell art both online and off, and we get better at it every day. And most importantly, we have the customer data. We have a diverse enough customer back or customer profile now, uh, number of customers, I should say, that we get to see what's working. We get to see the ones that are really, really selling art. What are they doing? What is different about the way that they're marketing, about the way they're approaching their businesses? So that's about us. Let's get into the platform. And I know what you're saying, a platform, what, why? Because that's what it takes. That's what it takes if we want to have successful customers. Made up of a website, the back office tools that you need to run the photo or art business online, uh, the marketing education, and then community. And it all starts with a website. And a website that is designed from the ground up to do one thing and one thing only, to sell art and photography both online and off. It's one of the big distinctions that we have because we're not designed to sell anything but art all the features are laser targeted to what you're trying to sell. The website's packed with features that you need, and it takes into account all of the nuances of selling art and photography online, of which there are many. Uh, now, we've got the features that everybody loves talking about. For instance, what we're seeing here is our wall preview tool. This allows your customers and potential customers to see your art on a wall, allows them to change the paint color to mimic what they have in their house, lets them change the, uh, the furniture and such, so that they're able to see it in a number of different situations. We have our brand new tool, which is our AR tool. What this allows you to do is your customers, potential customers can come to your website with their cell phone and they can look at a piece of art or photography, click one button, the live preview. And what we see now is someone is holding their cell phone up to an actual room in their house and they're able to move the art piece around, size it up, size it down, see what it looks like, does it do well in the room, does it match the furniture, how big of an order should they place, and they're able to do all of this from their cell phone and even screenshot it so that they can look at it after the fact. We also have tools like our, our media viewer, which you know your customers can view what the print might look like on paper, what it might look like on fine art paper, what it might look like on metal, and then also what it might look like as a canvas gallery wrap to help them begin to visualize what the art is gonna look like on their walls. And now, in addition to those features that everybody loves to talk about, we have so many that get less attention. Single page checkout for guests, fewer checkout steps for logged in users, size flexibility, media flexibility, the list goes on and on and on. And you wanna know the secret? It's not any individual feature. No, it's all of them. 
It's all of these features working in conjunction that take in all the nuances of what it is to sell art and photography online, that take your conversion rates from where they were to almost non-existent to actually converting your visitors and customers, potential customers into sales. That's what it takes. In summary, you get a website designed from the ground up to sell art, whether that be originals or prints or any combination in between. You get world-class support as well to help you and support you every step of the way for your entire life as a customer. You get up and running and have the time to focus on growing your business and not learning to be an IT expert or how to set up a website that is properly equipped to sell art online. Now we get to talk about the back office tools, the nuts and bolts of what it takes to run an art or photo business online. And this is important. Why? Because admin is for the birds, I say. Not knocking admin, but... Our platform has been designed from the ground up to take as many of these admin parts of running your business as possible and automate them. Things like your order management, your contact management, your database, your transactional communications when you make sales, your stats and user tracking, plus a whole lot more. Why? So you can stay laser focused on the things that matter, creating and then growing your business, not doing admin and paperwork. Put that all together, and like Bianca here, you're making sales when you sleep. Your website needs to be set up and equipped, and you need the back office tools such that you can sell and fulfill orders while you sleep, get paid, and stay focused on the creating and growing the business. Let's talk about print on demand. Whether you want to print and ship yourself, or use your local shop to fulfill your orders, or have everything done for you without having to lift a finger, we have you covered. All options are on the table. Now, we've partnered with a number of print studios across the United States and Canada uh, that can fulfill all of your print-related needs. All media types and options are available. You can print, ship, get paid, all without lifting a finger or having to do any admin work. Need to ship international? No problem. We've got extremely competitive rates. You can take orders from anywhere in the world. Now, we're also grown to the point recently where we're starting to get group pricing and discounts that we're able to offer to our customers on select items, better prices than you would get if you just walked in off the street to these print shops. In summary, our platform automates as much of the back office admin as possible. Stop wasting time on it. Print, ship, and fulfill your orders any way you like. Remove this burden completely as best you can so you can focus on the things that matter, creating and growing your business. Now we get into my favorite, which is the marketing. We'll give you a BA, a Bachelor's of Arts in Marketing, minus the school part, minus the school debt, minus the four years. Marketing is our secret sauce, which means it's going to be your secret sauce too. Yes, we have the blog and the podcast, a fantastic start. Yes, your site is set up to effectively market from the get-go. Yes, we teach you on the basics of marketing. Andy ran the basics. The basics work. Made a big sale. That's how it works every time. The basics work. It's, they're called the basics for a reason. We follow up with that and we build on it. We give you a detailed marketing plan that you can use all year long. Uh, what you should be doing all year long, focus is everything. What to do with your weekly marketing, what you should be focusing on for every week of the calendar year. When to run your sales, pro probably even more importantly, when to start preparing for your sales so you're not sending some last minute email if you send any email at all. How often to post on social? What networks are best? What to post? plus so, so much more. All you have to do is follow the plan and do the work. Andrea did. She took our advice. She got everything set up, listened to the podcast, put everything into place, posted on Facebook, and within 30 minutes of the post, she sold a big painting and almost paid back her investment in art storefronts. And the point here is, is, is not any one individual thing she did. It's all of the things, doing the work, following the plan. Sounds simple, right? And it is, it is. Is that it though? Is that all it takes? No, we're just getting started. In addition to everything that I've described, I wanna introduce you to our playbooks. These are complete plans on how to market and sell art and photography both online and off. Uh, we've got playbooks on things like what to do during the big holidays like Q4, which includes Black Friday, Cyber Monday, and Christmas in there. Uh, playbooks for Mother's Day, Valentine's Day, how to effectively sell art at fairs and shows, art or photography, and how to combine the offline with the digital piece to get way more ROI out of your shows. That's one of my favorites. And then even how to run contests on Facebook with chatbots, as well as bolt chatbots into your art selling. We believe that chatbots and messaging is going to categorically and drastically change the way things are purchased online. And we're already deep in the water, have playbooks that our customers are using. 
What do these playbooks contain? Let's go over briefly a, a sample of what you can expect. Uh, when to start and stop your campaign. How many emails to send. When subject lines you should be using. Email templates that you can download and import and then just plug your information into. Uh, what to do about discounts. What's the right percentage? What can you expect to get? Uh, how to email those that did not open the first email. How to coordinate your social with email so you maximize the attention, the ROI you get. How to leverage Instagram stories. What about scarcity? When do you make the deal expire? How do you approach that? How to run Facebook ads and Instagram ads, again, in conjunction with the entire campaign. How to incorporate Facebook Messenger and chatbots. How to end the sale. How to email the folks that added to the cart and didn't check out. And how to extend the deals. And then lastly, how to analyze the data and get better that next year comes around that next sale or for your next sale period. Carl did it. He ran our Valentine's Day playbook, sold a nice piece for 600 bucks at 10% off and five straight months of sales. Good for you, Carl. Now you combine the website designed to sell art plus the education plus the marketing plan and plus the playbooks and you are really starting to cook with gas. And that sounds amazing, right? Is that it though? No, no. The education alone is not enough. Just like a website is not enough without great support, the same applies to marketing. What we teach is incredibly detailed and tactical. It needs to be. That's what it takes. And you're inevitably going to get stuck. You're going to hit a wall. You're going to get frustrated. You're going to want to punch through your laptop here. So we do both group coaching and training. Think of it as having your own art marketing consultant minus the monthly retainer and subpar results. The Art Storefronts marketing staff will help you with things like coaching you on how to run the playbooks. Take a look at your Facebook ad campaigns and help you to understand what's working, what's not. Uh, advise you on SEO, how much of it you need to do, how long it should take, or if you should do it at all. Audit your stats and let you know what your various different traffic sources look like, which ones you should double down on. Help with marketing-related IT issues. Inevitably, we're going to give you services that you run. You're going to hit a wall. We're there to help. Help building your chatbot. Diagnose why things might not be selling. Now, we've already learned all of the lessons the hard way, so you don't have to. Also, we've got the data. We know how these things are supposed to go. Whatever the issue, you effectively have marketing consultants at hand to fix it, get you unstuck, and make the technically hard easy. Wait, you're already pretty good at marketing? Fantastic. Great. Uh, you combine our experience and customer data on what is working, and we will quickly level up your skills and make you even better at marketing. In summary, you start with the website that is set up for marketing and selling art. We educate you and get you set up with the basics. We give you a marketing plan you can follow all year long. You know what to focus on, what you should be doing week in, week out. We provide you with the step-by-step -step playbooks for all the big events, both online and offline. Our marketing staff is there to help you implement all of the above. It's like having your own art marketing consultant on hand, minus the retainer. Let's talk about community. With Art Storefronts, you will never be alone. All Art Storefronts customers become members of our private Facebook group we call Small Wins. It's the venue we use to do a lot of our group coaching and marketing support, yet it's so much more than that. We use it to celebrate Small Wins. Things like when a customer gets their very first order. There's absolutely nothing more exciting when you get the email that you got your first sale for the dollar amount. It's something that we love to celebrate. Nothing gets us more fired up and nothing gets our customers more fired up. The entrepreneurial road, though, is a lonely one. There are ups and downs constantly. Having a community of like-minded peers going through it together, it makes all the difference. You've got 2,000 plus artists and photographers all working on solving the same problems at the same time, running the same playbooks, and all learning from one another. Yes, we share our successes in the group, but also when things are tough, when things are not going your way, there's people there to help you and support you. Uh, we encourage one another to keep going when you hit those low points. We share what is working. You get to learn what's the greatest, latest and greatest from people that are on the ground doing it. And you get to learn from others' mistakes so you don't have to make them on your dime and your time. Maintain perspective on how long things take, on how long it takes to build a thriving online business to keep you encouraged on doing the work daily. The community ends up being everything. In summary, from the moment you become a customer, you'll never be alone in your journey as an entrepreneur. Shared learnings on what is working and what you can implement in your business. Get answers on all of the tough questions that arise that others have already solved. The ASF staff and community will be with you every step of the way, year in and year out. And then there's thousands of artists and photographers all working on the same marketing plan together at the same time. The learnings from something like that just become profound. The creativity that you're able to 
you know, tap into and, and tweak to fit what you do and your style. It's just, it's, it becomes amazing. That's the platform. Let's talk about you. And it, it sounds like a lot, right? There's a lot of pieces to that. And it is, it is a lot. Why? That's what it takes. That's what it takes. You know, you have to combine all of these elements into a total art selling platform. You do this and you're creating the ideal conditions for your customers to succeed. You make progress in their businesses day by day, month by month, year over year, so that they can achieve the level of success that they desire for their businesses and lives. And that is what we do at Art Storefronts. That is what a total art and photography selling platform looks like. What about you? The good news is that regardless if you're just getting started, you're picking up steam, or you're really rolling, we believe we can help you. If that sounds interesting, then click the request a demo button below and we'll follow up with you. We'll put you through a short survey to find out more about you and where you are in your journey. Then we'll tailor things to where you are and advise you what steps you should take next. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.